Hey guys, what's up? It's Hannah, and uh, today I'm going to be teaching you how to play Mess I Made by Parachute. It's kind of an old song, but it's so good, and I love playing it. So, um, yeah, it's really not hard at all. So, um, let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so first of all, you need a capo on your first fret. Um, there's only four chords in this song. Super easy. I'm just going to teach you the chords, and then I'll tell you the order um, for the verses and chorus. So your first um, chord is a G. Your pointer finger on the 5th string, 2nd fret, your middle finger on the 6th string, 3rd fret, and your ring finger on the 1st string of the 3rd fret. And then a D, pointer finger on the 3rd string, 2nd fret, your middle finger on the 1st string, 2nd fret, and then your ring finger on the 2nd string, on the 3rd fret. Then an E minor, your pointer finger on the 5th string, 2nd fret, and your middle finger on the 4th string, 2nd fret. And then a C, your pointer finger on the 2nd string, 1st fret, your middle finger on the 4th string, on the 2nd fret, and then your ring finger on the 5th string on the 3rd fret. So that is a C. Okay, now for the order, um, for the verse, is actually just like I taught it. Um, it goes G, D, E minor, and C. And now for the chorus, um, you do D, E minor, C, G, E minor, C, G, E minor, C, G, D, E minor, C, G. I know that sounds confusing, but basically what you're doing, you're doing the D, E minor, C, G, and then E minor, C, G twice, and then just go back to the D, E minor, C, and then G. Um, and then for the bridge, is G, D, E minor, and C, just like the verse. So it's really not that hard once you get it, I promise. Okay, so you have a few different kind of strumming patterns in the song, just because um, it starts quiet and then it escalates more. Um, so first, you're just doing single strums. Um, that's obviously super easy. Um, the next, you're going to go into down, 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 up, down, 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 up. So I think that's eight downs and then one up. Um, it just, it goes really well with the song. You'll be able to hear it. Um, let's just see. Down, down. That's how that sounds. And then once you really get into the song, it's just down, 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 up. So that's four downs and one up. You're just cutting that last one kind of in half. So what it sounds like is down. Okay, so um, for the chorus, though, what you're going to do is you're playing down, 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 up for the D, E minor, and C, so it sounds like down. But then for the G, you're doing up, 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 down, up. It's like the really long strumming pattern that I use a lot, just split in half. So you have down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, up, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, up, down, down, up. It is kind of confusing, just go really slow and take your time. So just remember it's the down, 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 up, 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 down, down, up, down, up strumming pattern. You're just splitting it between the chords. So again, right after you finish that G, the down, 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 up, just go into the G doing the up, 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 down, down, up. Okay, so just take your time. Don't get too frustrated. Um, but what I do want to tell you about in the chorus, um, when you play that G, you play it twice because it runs into the next line. So I'll just kind of give you an example so you know. So it'll sound like, um, Oh, I'm staring at the mess I made again. I'm staring at the mess I made again. I'm staring at the mess I made as you turn. You take your heart and walk. So um, that G has to get played twice before you go into the next line, just because it kind of overlaps. But um, when I play it, it'll probably make sense. And just listen to the song. Um, and then on the bridge, it's that same strumming pattern. Okay, so I'm going to play through the first... Um, actually, I think I'm going to play through almost all of this song, just because the strumming pattern changes so much. But I'm not going to sing it. I'm just going to talk it. So, yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this.
I have to look at the lyrics though, I'm sorry. Okay, ready? Here we go, starting on G. I should have kissed you there. I should have held your face. I should have watched those eyes instead of proud in place. Well, that was messed up. Okay, try that again. I should have kissed you there. I should have held your face. I should have watched those eyes instead of proud in place. I should have called you out. I should have said your name. I should have turned around. I should have looked again. But oh, I'm staring at the mess I made. I'm staring at the mess I made. I'm staring at the mess I made as you turn. You take your heart and walk away. I should have held my ground. I should have been redeemed for every second chance. A change is mine on me. I should have spoken up. I should have proudly claimed. Oh, my head's to blame for all my heart's mistakes. And the rest of the song kind of follows that um, bridge, and then it will go back into the chorus. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, guys, well, I hope that helped. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below, or you can kick me or message me on Twitter or whatever you want to do. But all my information is in the down bar below. And um, remember to suggest songs so I know what to make tutorials for. And I just want to help y'all as much as I can. Or if you just have questions about any other songs that you don't really need a full tutorial for, yeah, comment down below or kick me or whatever you want to do. Whatever your little heart desires. Um, yeah, but anyway, so um, I guess that's about it for right now. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Just walked away.